So one day I get a text message from this clown. Okay, it says, I, got, I just sent you something. I'm like, okay, what is it? He's like, you're just gonna have to wait. So what happened was, is my dumb butt left to go on a tournament shoot, an episode. I said, hey man, I left my batteries at, um, I left my batteries at home. Now I gotta go back to these other crap batteries that I carry with me as backups. And he said, no you don't bro, tell me where you're at, tell me where you uh, need them sent and I'll get you some batteries and chargers to you so that I make sure you're taken care of for this shoot. So customer service like that for one wins me over. But great customer service is one thing, a great product is an even better thing, but when you combine great customer service and a great product, it's a home run. So these guys are the combination of both. That guy right there, and that guy right there, and the whole team, everybody that I've talked to, everybody that Christie's talked to, from order processing, and the folks at Fish USA said they were a dream to talk to for setting up. Anyway, these guys are the way to go for kayak fishing batteries. Uh, if you're a consumer looking for the best possible uh, power solution for your kayaks, your small crafts, even your big stuff, <laughs> then these guys are the way to go. But the reason I'm telling this story about the stuff getting sent to me is uh, I even tried to call him and twist his arm over the phone. You know how you do that? Come on, man. Don't send me some bull crap message like this. He's like, there's a little something special in the package for you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it over to Stormy and Bo and let them tell you about this little something special. I'll just give you a sneak peek. That thing right there that uh, he sent me. And the first time I saw it, I was like, I literally had a couple of boxes one of which was a, an ammo box that I was gonna convert into this power station. I always love it when I've got a really good idea and then the person that I call to tell my good idea kind of laughs at me with that little laugh, like, <laughs> that little laugh right there and says, hold on man, I'm gonna send you something. And then I get a product that kind of one up to what my idea was. So I'm gonna turn it over. I'm gonna let these guys tell you about, yeah, I'm just gonna turn it over and let them tell you about it. So anyway. All right, tell so about it, man. I blew. I blew the Chad man, the hooves mine, man. Um, this is our power box. And what we've done is, we've all seen the YouTube videos of these guys doing it, doing it yourself. And what we've done is we've commercialized it. We've, we've drilled down, put the necessities there that are dependable and that what we need in a small, compact package. This is almost the same size as the battery. What we have is we've got 12 volt cigarette volt uh, socket. We have two USB ports with a voltmeter. We have posts in case we have to wire anything or we have the U bolts. We can use the post. We also have Mr. Flashlight here for night fishing. So overall, it only weighs three and a half pounds. It will last you all weekend long for, or if not longer, for your cell phone, for your GoPros. Um, inside, it's all waterproof. We have our 7 amp hour battery, that's what it comes with. All of our wiring is professionally finished, done correctly. Closes up, watertight. And I said, here you go, who? Here's your battery box, man. So, so check this out. <laughs> so it came with the 7 amp hour battery, but I, I just had to swap it out because I'm one of those you know, more is more kind of guys. So I put the 10 amp hour battery in it, right? I set it up at a tournament for a charging station for people that needed to charge their iPhones and there was two cords there. It lasted the three days of the tournament with people charging their phones. And then I actually called Stormy two trips later when I said, dude, you know what the only problem with the Coda Lithium is? He like kind of laughed and said, what's that? I said, the suckers last too long because what ends up happening is you take for granted that it's going to last one more trip. So you try to milk it. And so I tried to milk one more trip out of it. Got out there, got halfway through the trip, and the battery died on me. After using, letting people charge their phones for three days at a tournament, I'd used it for one full day. I was about three hours into the next day. But the cool thing about it is these jokers are so light that I picked up two more of them. So Stormy sent me two in the beginning uh, because I said, look, man, I've got... Uh, a small fortune in lithium battery claims in my tool shed. He did that laugh right there, said, dude, I got you. So I put him to the test. What I did is I set him up in the shop on a bench. I set up a camera for time lapse yep. and I just ran a stern light, a standard stern light that I have mounted to the table and run them side by side. This thing lasted four and a quarter times as long 
as the previous battery, the worker batteries that I've used from bat uh, Batteries Plus for years, little security system battery, four and a half times as long, or four and a quarter times for the exact same amp hour rating. So again, these guys are either underrating it and sandbagging, or everybody else in the industry is freaking out of their mind. So if you're looking for the ultimate power solution, that's the name, Dakota Lithium. Uh, that's the brand right there. But more importantly, the customer service was there. Um, so I picked up a couple extra ones when I was in Fish USA. And what I did is I put these in little dry bags and I put two of the ones in little dry bags to keep the post from touching. You know, you don't want them to end up inside the bag arcing. And another dry bag and I just threw them inside my kayak. So that when I forgot about charging it, when I ran out on the water, it was as simple as pulling the dry bag out swapping the battery out and I was back for another day and a half two days with an HDS 9 carbon total scan all day long and part of another day with so yeah with four pounds of battery so if you're looking for the ultimate solution Dakota Luthium and then this power bank box uh, do we have a proprietary name for this yet I mean power box. so the power box yeah man the power box check out the power box from Dakota Lithium.